do. But in exchange, I expect you to serve me until your dying breath. Thank you, Lord Frieza. You have my word. I promise I won't let you down again. Listen up. The merciful Lord Frieza has given us a chance to return to his army. Now we will express our eternal joy and gratitude in the form of a dance. You really needn't bother. Oh, as you wish, my lord. Pardon my asking, Lord Frieza. Is it really a good thing they're back to normal? Seems to me they were better off the way they were before. I see your point. But in my army, all that matters is results. My apologies for the wait, Lord Frieza. The Ginyu Force has assembled. How excellent. I'm expecting great things from you and the Ginyu Force. Thank you, Lord Frieza. Honestly, it is truly an honor to serve you again. Shall I perform my dance of joy to express how delighted I am? If you like, I can perform a special version of the dance. <laughs> the dance of joy! Awesome! And it's the special version, too. No, that's unnecessary. Let's save the dancing for later, shall we? As you wish. After the matter is resolved, the Ginyu Force and I will perform the most splendid dance for you. I'm looking forward to your recital. Listen up! This is our chance to impress Lord Frieza. I want all of you to practice until showtime. You can count on us, Captain Ginyu! Whether it's on the battlefield or off, we'll be sure to dance a little freezer with our moves. All right, man. Now that that's decided, let's show this enemy the might of the Ginyu Force. Ginyu Force, let's go! Yes, yes sir. sir! I do wish he'd do something about that eccentric personality of his. Very good. Now that we have Captain Ginyu with us, I would say things are going quite well. Lord Frieza, are you sure it's okay to let that Earthling Freeloader remain in your body? Of course not. I detest the thought. But I need that maggot to draw out all of my power. When you consider the dangers we face, letting a maggot roost in one's body doesn't seem that bad. All things considered, I'd like to gather us some more pawns, however. So, they revived you too. Now, things are getting interesting. Hey! What business do you have with Lord Frieza? My name is Cell. I would be more than happy to join, if you're sure you want to live. What? Behave, Nappa! You will soon learn it. Smart Mutts know when to stop their barking. But, but sir! Nappa, Lord Frieza gave you an order! Your subordinates seem rather undisciplined. Is the Frieza Force nothing but a group of halfwits? Hey, you better watch your tongue. Captain Ginyu, not you too. I think it's best to hear what Bug Boy has to say. <laughs> Lord Frieza just saved your life, punk. All right, then. Let's get down to business. Where is the being who revived me and allowed some strange soul to take complete control of my body? Strange soul? You mean they did the same thing to you? Perhaps she plans to utilize many more people than we realize. Excuse me? Did you say she? So you do know something about this? Even if we did, who says we need to share this with you? I do. First, you need to show me some respect. Ask me nicely, and I just may consider it. <laughs> what an unbelievably banal request. I don't care what you want. Tell me everything you know. I see. It would appear that this fellow is much slower in the head than I first assumed. Isn't that special? No matter. 
I'll just have to teach you the hard way. Are you ready? Go! Oh, what the? It's cool. a dead wish. Ever see this one? Oh, what the? Is that all? I guess it's not that bad. You seem much different from the data I have on you. It's like you've become something completely different all of a sudden. Why is it, Frieza? I'm getting the sense there's another energy inside you. You are somehow different from me. Like you've been possessed by another being's soul. If we're so different, then please explain what it is inside of you. Ah, well that is another story. I have something akin to an artificial soul that's been pre-programmed, which would explain why I find it so easy to control. What? You can control the soul inside you? Indeed. In fact, it was so easy to overpower that I didn't even need to waste my time and effort expelling it. Hmm... I don't know who's inside of you right now, but thanks to their soul, your full power is at your disposal. I'm correct, aren't I? Surely, being linked with this Earthling must be what allowed me to tap into some of my power. Although, my true power is so much greater than this. Interesting. There must be some logical mistake then. The data I have on you must be outdated. Amusing. How about I allow you to come and work for me? Lord Frieza, if I may, I don't believe it would do us well to work with this creature. I agree. There's no telling when that freak might betray us. None of this matters. Cell doesn't work for anyone. However, you could all prove to be of actual use to me. I suppose I don't mind teaming up, at least temporarily. So be it. I suppose there are small benefits in a group effort. Nevertheless, if you prove useless or dare to betray me, then I will be forced to erase you. No hard feelings. <laughs> the same goes for both sides. Wow, things are getting interesting now. Something happened? It looks like Cell has joined forces, with Frieza of all people. What? I've never seen you look like that before. <laughs> you do get surprised. Although, is it really that much of a surprise? Both of them were uncontrollable, so it might have just been a matter of time. True, but are you sure this is okay? They could pose a threat together. Not necessarily, Sixteen. The one who truly poses a threat is the soul inside Frieza. The live human soul is the real reason why Frieza was able to draw out so much of his power. I've been watching and trying to figure out why a human ended up getting linked to him. But this link is too dangerous to ignore. We need to act fast. Eighteen, you need to go defeat Frieza and Cell. Think of it as your link test. Sure, not a problem. I'll destroy anyone who gets in my way. <laughs> That's what I like to hear. I'm excited to watch you. Meanwhile, Sixteen, you need to prepare a snack for when she gets back. Understood. Well, I guess it's time to go hunting! Don't you worry about this! I'm gonna plow through all these chumps! 
I appreciate your enthusiasm, but don't let that get you killed and sent back to hell. Where you belong. What are you trying to say? That I'm gonna lose? I wonder. 